hi gentlemen thanks for watching uh, uh, this particular youtube channel and uh, today's of uh, people and culture word uh, for 7th november 2022 is pink slip okay the dictionary meaning uh, everyone knows uh, most probably basically it is practiced in many it its and mnc companies and uh, the dictionary meaning is an informal term that refers to a notice of dismissal which is given to an employee the person engaged who's on the role okay at work what exactly is the uh, definition or meaning it's basically a kind of a layoff uh, a, a, a pink slip a person given a pink slip is uh, considered that he was or she was laid off the second one is mostly it is due to project closure or uh, there is no enough uh, project is there uh, the next uh, project has not uh, uh, allotted to that particular group things like that third one uh, otherwise the particular position in that particular uh, project becomes uh, you know, um, void or not required or and the, the person has to be eliminated for some some reason the performance is not good or uh, the, the project has come to a, a closure or going to come to a closure uh, the end of the period of uh, that project uh, not much employees are required things like that and the services of one single employee or group of employee or all employees will be uh not required and they will be discharged fourth one this particular pink slip issuing pink slip is neither considered as a dismissal nor a punitive termination it's a, a termination with uh, a reason kind of a punishment it is not like that the fifth one it will be like a sudden decision the management would be thinking for a long time and suddenly they may decide that one fine day they wanted to issue a pink slip and meaning that from that day usually in big companies like uh, you know very recently also uh, in big uh, one, one one us company people have been asked to go like uh, the the uh, the email id was blocked and uh, meaning that the person has been laid off th things like that so something will happen suddenly and if people will be calling and uh, asking why this has happened and they'll be told that they have been laid off and uh, sixth one usually such employees paid with the severance pay severance pay is uh, uh, not a retrenchment compensation it will be more than the retrenchment compensation which is paid in, in as per indian law uh, any company will be paying uh, a kind of uh, more than the retrenchment compensation which is 15 days uh, salary of every completed years but here they will be paying uh, a notice pay as well as some severance extra salary will be paid and uh, <clears throat> uh, that's what i had mentioned uh, it is more than the legal requirement and this is basically happening in all commercial establishment it its and mncs but uh, usually this will not be practiced in manufacturing sector because they usually do not do fearing that there will be a industrial dispute that will be a long legal battle things like that it may usually will not be practiced in manufacturing facilities in in a few factories uh, this may be practiced but uh, not for uh, no they they know this in advance and what they usually do is uh, uh, they will outsource the entire service or they will engage uh, such services through third party vendors so there will not be a big headache for them they, they just like that you know terminate the contract with a third party vendor then everybody has to go and uh, the contractor will manage uh, the the separation of such employees okay thank you we'll uh, um, meet up tomorrow with a new word thank you have a nice day